Dominique, Nika, Nika, s'en allait tout simplement au oh Dieu, pauvre et chantant. En tout chemin, en tout lieu, il ne parle que du bon Dieu, il ne parle que du bon Dieu. Brothers and sisters, happy Valentine's Day! This Valentine's Day is now known in the whole world, but where does it come from? Valentine's Day came only after World War II to us, but the day itself has a far longer tradition. Before it became the day of the lovers, February 14th was the day of the betrayer Judas. And in the Bohemian, Silesian and in the Northern German tradition or superstition, children born at this date didn't grow old. Yes, but then came the Holy Valentine. If he really existed or when he was born or where and when he died is unknown. He, Saint Valentine, could be a priest of the 3rd century who married couples in the Christian ritual and the Empire has forbidden this. So yes, it was an easy way for him to become a Saint Martyr. It was important also for the Roman Catholic Church having his own saint of this day to replace Juno. February 14th was the day of the Roman goddess Juno and Juno was the goddess of marriage and birth. So all known Catholics, you're worshipping a saint and I doubt your loved ones would accept your pagan argument not to contribute in this other commercial holiday. I decide to love my relatives the whole year and not only at this organized day. Therefore, I worship today the Orthodox Saint Trifon. To worship Saint Trifon, we are going to the vineyards, cutting some wood from the grapevine and wash this wound with wine from the last year. There will be musicians, dance and singing and nobody would risk the damnation of Saint Trifon by going home without being completely pissed. The more you're drunk, the more benedictions you will have from Saint Trifon for the whole year. Have a nice day, independent what you are celebrating today. I will now try to find an internet cafe to upload this video. So, for the moment, until I'm back, caress you and thank you very much. Comment.